Okay. I consider myself to be a pretty intelligent individual. Even so, there are some questions that I just don't know the answer to. And since I'm talking to everyone in the world, I'll make a deal with you. I'll answer one of the questions that you evidently don't know the answer to, and maybe somebody out there can answer one of the questions that I don't know the answer to. Here's a question that puzzles people, and I don't understand why. Is this glass half empty or half full? Now, I consider that to be a stupid-ass question because it's obvious. If I'm drinking out of the glass, it's half empty. If I'm pouring liquid into the glass, it's half full. What is the problem with understanding the half full, half empty thing? I just don't get that. But that's the answer to that. This is the one that I don't know the answer to. Well, not the what came first, the chicken or the egg thing. I know the answer to that. That's an easy one. That's, that's not the one I'm, the question I had about the egg. The question I have about the egg is that all around the world, there are hen houses all over the world. Every morning, a farmer goes out to the hen house, reaches under a chicken, pulls out an egg, puts it in a carton, ships them out to uh, grocery stores all over the world. You go to the grocery store, buy a carton of eggs, take it home, bust it open. There you go. You got breakfast, liquid chicken. But now, if you think about it, if the farmer did not take this egg from underneath the chicken, it would have grown up to be another chicken. Now, you see, my question is that there are all these hen houses all over the world, filled with hens. But on each one of those farms, there's only one rooster. Now, you mean to tell me that that one rooster goes in that hen house every night and bangs all those chickens? <laughs> Is that what happens? I mean, really? I mean, one rooster, a house full of hens, not only does he fuck them all, but he knocks them up. I mean, damn. One rooster, all night long, he just goes in there and just, you know, I mean, they ought to take a picture of this, have a camera inside the hen house, and be like, chicken porn. You know, I wouldn't get off on this, but it's, I'd just like to see it. You know, he's going for chicken, chicken, bam, 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 bam. That's, that's why he come out of the hen house early in the morning, got a cigarette hanging out of his mouth, you know, talk about, ah, 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 ah. that's chicken for, I screwed every one of them. It's like, damn. One rooster bangs all those chickens and gets them every morning. And each one of them gets an egg. I'm like, goodness, he done knocked up all the chickens in the hen house every night. That's what goes on. You know, I, this is unbelievable. It's impossible. I don't believe it. I mean, how could that happen? I mean, but you know, now that I think about it, whenever you get two roosters together, it's called a cockfight. <laughs> but I don't, I, I can't figure out the answer to that. I mean, that's. Impossible. I just don't believe that could happen. I mean, I, 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 if somebody in the world knows the answer to that question, I answered the one about the half glass, half full, half empty. I don't know the answer to the chicken and the rooster in the hen house.